Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Now today we're giving you an update on a Southern Coastal Highway Improvement Project. Now we are actually going through Bull Bay now and a subscriber had asked us to point out where the whole police station was in terms of the road. Well, we're coming up to it on the right where you see that blue building straight ahead on the right police station was right beside that building and it has been removed to make way for the highway now that police station was so old that it is a national heritage site like all the train stations once they were built they were never upgraded almost every train station in Jamaica okay right there now where you actually we can do this that is it where you see that blue fence the blue gate the mesh fence that was where the police station was and it was never upgraded from it was built in the 1800s it has never been upgraded well progress it's been upgraded a new station is actually going to be built a new station fit, built to purpose is going to be built for bull bay and this area is going to see so much economic benefit from the building of this highway. It's unbelievable. There is actually a luxury hotel to be built, first of many, in Bull Bay. A new police station is going to be built, and it's just a matter of time before they're going to Bull Bay as a town is going to grow and it's going to get a fire station up. Probably has a post office already. I'm not sure, but maybe those post offices could be heritage sites though, the way they are so old i'm not sure why i mean over a hundred years and you have upgraded a police station anyway we'll work with it but yes there are some buildings that are heritage sites but there are also some buildings that need to be upgraded like when they start back up the train service, there is no way they could possibly think of using those old stations. If you want to keep them for historic value, great, but you have to build new ones. Bull Bay should have gotten a new police station a long time ago. There is no way a station built 100 or 200 years ago could still be working efficiently in the year 2023. But We'll work with it. The station was removed because though there is a sign for another stoplight. Yeah, I guess you need them. Why not? But it's just very strange to see a stoplight on a highway. But we have to remember that this is not like Highway 2000. This is a different kind of road. But it looks like a highway that you would think of in a regular sense. Alright, so what were we... Oh yes, the road was expanded from two lanes to four lanes. So that means all the structures, and there were over 600 of them, that were right beside the road, had to be removed on one side. And the police station was one of those roads. So that's why the police station was removed. It was one of those structures right beside the road. Now they've built a temporary police station or they renovated a building to be used as a temporary police station while they work on building a new one. But just want to point out that not every building that's 100 or 200 years old should be kept as a heritage site. Some of them need to be renovated or upgraded and some of them just need to be demolished and a new building built. I'm not saying to demolish the ones that you need for, historic, for history, but not every building that is 200 years old should be kept. Well, I know we did a video on Spanish Town and a lot of people commented that the building, some of the buildings should be kept for historic value. Okay, so this is the, where the, the police station was now. And we're going to give you a tour of the new facility that is being used 
as the temporary police station. But the major part of the road work is finished. What's left is just paving the road. I guess, I'm not sure why they haven't paved this side yet. Actually, it looks like it was paved and it was dug up. I think we, were, we had done that in another video. It was paved, see? There is paved, it was paved, but it was dug up. I'm not sure why, but it's a work in progress. You're going to have these, these issues along the way. I mean, if I was to guess, no, I'm just guessing, I'm just assuming, why would you dig up a road that was recent? The road was paved and sections dug up. Why would you dig up a road that was recently paved and one, one institution will come to mind? One word, one, one entity is famous for doing that, famous. I won't call the name, but I'm just saying, everybody knows. What would have caused them to have to dig up that road? Well, this project is definitely coming along nicely and it will definitely make the December 31st better. Uh, we're going to turn back around now and continue the tour towards 10 miles Bull Bay and then 12 miles Bull Bay and then Grand Spen, then Albion, then Yellows. This definitely does not look good. I wish they would um, do some more, something more to block that hole so that you know you, you can see it further away. Like put up a cone or fix that orange thing around it. I hate to think at night somebody drops in there. All right, guys, thanks for taking a tour with us today. Remember to like, share, and subscribe. Have a good day.